rather more personal setting, if I yes. may, and let's bring the conversation to Nigeria. Yes. I've looked across the Nigerian press, I've listened to people uh, from the National Assembly, mm -hmm. and I've also looked at some records coming out of the courts yes. uh, in your country and in America as well, and there are serious allegations mm -hmm. concerning you and your family and mm -hmm. corruption and kickbacks. Now, are mm -hmm. you prepared to face those charges and to give a full accounting? I'm very, very much so. Very much so. And if you have any evidence, Steve, please show it to me. And I will defend myself anywhere in the world. Well, because let, what let, you are right, saying let, is, let's, let's... is absolute nonsense without due respect. I am the only leader in Nigeria that has been examined and reported upon by the anti corruption uh, bodies in Nigeria. I am the only one. When, you, when the... your successor took over, he yes. described corruption in the country as endemic, and he said it was the country's elite that was responsible. Well, he's one of them. One he's of one, what? He's one of Nigeria's elite. Well, and of course he, he is, and he's saying, yes. as he takes over and yes. looks at what is happening inside government, yes. there is corruption to the very top. That now, doesn't, doesn't reflect that, well on if you. If he said that, did he mention of Basanjo? Did he mention Obasanjo, Steve? But you were the president. I you am were responsible president. for the governance no, of your country. No, you I'm not responsible for the corruption of all every Nigerian. Not every I'm Nigerian, not. but yes. you are in the now, end the uh, chief now, executive now, of a country please, which your own successor please, says is Steve, endemically you have, corrupt. You have made strong allegation against me personally well, it, and I, against my family. I'm coming to and that. You have I'm no, coming, I'm you coming have to no that. way to substantiate it. Substantiate it. Let's, and it's not that this is something let's where talk. you are taking undue advantage. No, let's, I will have even say that. Let, let's talk. I, I will go beyond here. Well, let's talk specifics yes. then. Stay, uh, Halliburton talks. and yes. various Halliburton subsidiaries yes. have paid vast amounts of money in fines in the yes. United States because of bribes and corruption paid out to Nigerian officials. And yes. if one takes now, the testimony... Are, yes, are those Nigerian officials, am I one of them? Well, let's talk about that. Yes, am Albert, I one of them? Albert Steve? Jack Stanley confessed yes. last year in yes. the United States to bribing, and this is according to a U.S. Yes. court document, yes. quote, yes. three successive holders of a top-level office in the executive branch of the Nigerian government. He negotiated yes. with these office holders' representatives yes. regarding the amount of bribes that would be paid. Yes. Now, if one cross-checks that, the, uh, uh, well, I, I'm coming to that, yes. if one cross-checks that with yes. the testimony before a French prosecutor, yes. Jeffrey Tesla, yes. another Halliburton yes. agent involved, yes. I'm sure you know these names, yes. Yes. he named you as one of three successive Nigerian heads of state who'd been involved in negotiations with the Halliburton subsidiaries, which were later in a U.S. court found to have been guilty of bribes and corruption on a massive scale. Tesla will never say that. Tesla. It's in the te French record. Let Tesla bring out the... Because by the time when you say somebody is guilty of corruption, there must be the giver, there must be the taker, and there must be the evidence. Did you have communication with Jeffrey Tesla? No. Never? No. Absolutely no. I, Despite anything not, he has not testified. Not me personally. As you know, he's been arrested. Yes. And the U.S. is now seeking his extradition. Okay. Are you worried about okay. what he may say I am in not a worried. U.S. court? I am not worried. He would bring evidence. I'm not worried. I am not worried. I am very, very sure of my position and my stand. All right? I do not say that people in my government were not corrupt. But I am well, let, let's stop you just there. Yes. Are you saying that people in your government were corrupt? Of course, I will not. Can you say the uh, people in the government of any country are not corrupt? Yeah, but I'm talking about senior people. Yes. I'm talking about ministers. I'm talking about your closest allies. Do you now well, believe some of them were corrupt? Well, my uh, uh, vice president had something to do with uh, Jefferson, which is part of the case in, um, in America. I don't know whether, whether corruption has been proved or not, but he had a, a question to Is ask. Is it not a terrible failing? We'll leave aside, yes. perhaps for the courts, to decide yes. whether you personally can be held to account for okay. any of this. But, yeah. but do you accept it was a terrible failing for you as president to see inside your government, at the very top of your government, according to your own successor, that there was rampant corruption? I do not accept that because... 
if any in any government somebody is found to be corrupt the onus lie on the head of that government to bring that man to book when i was the head of government there's no case of corruption against any uh, uh, minister any high government official but that just that shows the system doesn't work no i don't agree with you but you've admitted fact, to me please, that corruption please, was yeah was please. prevalent in your country when no. you were president yes and yet not now, one senior official inside your federal government has been convicted of serious corruption. I do corruption. not agree with you. You don't have your right, your, uh, your uh, facts correct. In my government, two mini uh, three ministers were charged to court. In fact, one died in the process. The inspector general of police was charged and convicted. The president of the Senate in my own party was charged to court. A minister of education was charged to court. What more do you want? One Not those, to talk of min, uh, one of those, one of those people who now, currently people, is under investigation like you, is your own like eldest you. daughter. Yes, your my, own eldest daughter. Yes, what happened to my eldest daughter? She is still being investigated by the anti-corruption watchdog so inside what? your own country. So what? Has he Would you found accept responsibility for I, her? I, no, why should I? He's old enough. He's a girl of 42 years old. Will you accept responsibility for your son at the age of 21 for whatever he does? Now, don't ask me that type of question. I found it very insulting, with all due respect. Now, you won't ask that type of question to a European leader. I Let think me, you'd please, find if a European please, leader, if please, a European leader please, whose daughter was in yes, a European I, Senate please, was accused of serious fraud charges, not, that would it, that's not an reflect. Allegation. That's an allegation. And anything can be alleged. You can be alleged to be a liar. And when it is not, when it's investigated, if you are not a liar, that is the allegation goes. That's an allegation. And what, you what don't it, work on allegations. I, I said it was an. Work. I said it was an allegation. Yes, I accepted the allegation. Where you have, where what I would. What I yes. would ask you before we finish is this: yes. Nigeria is one of the, uh, in terms of resources, richest countries in the world. I think you're number seven, no, number eight are, in terms of oil are, exports in the entire world. We are potentially rich country. We are not. Well, rich your oil country. reserves are proven and they are vast. And yet, according to UN figures something like a third of your population lives in extreme poverty and that was the case when you left office can you explain yeah. why that was the case now we have oil but compared with the population of nigeria of over 150 million and the oil that we are getting compared with any other country what is the population of saudi arabia we are producing today less than 1.8 million barrels of oil a day. Saudi Arabia is producing 9 million barrels. Now you cannot compare. So, or um, UAE uh, or Kuwait. So when you make this comparison, make it in the right context. But would you accept that Nigeria, I, I Nigeria has not utilized the opportunities and resources that it has? I don't agree with you. Nigeria has used the opportunities and resources that it had to the best of its uh, ability. But I will say there have been lapses. And, there, and you can say the same thing of any country. Now, and the fact that Nigeria is fighting these lapses and is doing something about it, I think one should even say uh, hooray to Nigeria. There are many countries where these things are covered up. In our own case, we are ready to go out and say, yes, we set up, under my own administration, two bodies, unlike any other country, that are fighting corruption. Two bodies. And even here, the Metropolitan Police gave us uh, uh, kudos. Uh, so the uh, way a final we thought, because we must end, but yeah. uh, your successor, President.